Well guys, the parades are back and they're coming thick and fast. But this week on Fan Fan TV, we have a little bit of this. A little bit of this. A wee bit more of this. And finish with a wee bit of SPP. thank Corbett Accordion for the invite down to Ban Bridge on Friday night and I'd like to thank Ewan for doing the five question interview. Here's an interview and a wee clip of Corbett. This is Ban Fan TV and tonight should have been Corbett's annual parade around Ban Bridge but instead Corbett played a few tunes just in front of the War Memorial and Leda Reef. I have Ewan with me and Ewan's going to do the five question interview. Ewan thanks for doing this. Yeah no bother. What age did you join your first band? Uh, I think I was 13 or 14 when I joined the Corbett, so that was my first band, oh, well, and first. I'm still here. 13 or 14, <laughs> so, that's not too yeah. bad. And what age are you now? I'm 22. Oh, you're sticking it yeah. rightly, so you are. <laughs> Why did you join the band? Uh, I just, I really loved the accordion. I remember loving the accordion, and uh, I loved the band culture too. I would have been at a lot of band parades, you know, with my friends and that. And uh, I was sort of looking for a wee band to join, and somebody who I'm related to him, Uncle, he suggested the Corbett. Yep. But, uh, so then I was desperate to get into it. <laughs> and eventually my man and dad let me join, and I've never left since, so. And did it take you long to learn the, the accordion? Uh, well, you're sort of still learning all the time, but yes. uh, I was, I joined in the June or July, I think. Uh -huh. And then I went out in the September. But it would have been quite dodgy, I'd say, until probably the freighting season after. After, right. <laughs> Do you have a favorite tune? Uh, yes, I do. It's Black Man's Dream. You like that? I yeah. love the parts and I love the. I just love the tune. It's a lovely tune. So yes, it yes. What about a favourite parade? Favourite parade? Gosh. I'd have to say. I'd have to say the Downchurch Band Parade. Yes. Except unless, if you're discluding Scarva, and, uh, I'll say the Downchurch Band Parade. Because it's in our hometown and. Yeah. You know, uh -huh. it's just a good walk. Yes, <laughs> yes. Atmosphere. Last one. What's your plans for the future? Have you anything built up for NI21 or for the season coming in? Uh, well, I'm just sort of hoping that we get out. Yes. That's all, to be honest, with COVID and all that. Yes. And hopefully we will. Hopefully. But that's really my only plans. I've not planned too far ahead these days. No, it's hard to, hard to predict <laughs> the things the way they are. Well, that's five question interview. Ian, thank you very no much bother. for doing this. Thank you very much. And uh, it's been a pleasure. Yes, great having you. Thank you. Thank you.
Saturday afternoon was Billy Selwyn Volunteers Memorial Parade in North Belfast. Eight bands were on parade, including Billy Selwyn. Here's a short clip of Clapburn Young Conkers looking very smart in their new uniform. We have quite a list of bands that are on the march this weekend. Again, all these parades are subject to change with COVID restrictions. So keep an eye out on the social media for the band that hopefully is marching near you. We're going to finish this week with a wee clip of Shankle Prasen Boys, or the Champions as some we call them. If you want to see more clips from Valley Sounds Parade and more clips of Corbett Accordion, please check out On The March YouTube channel. Subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up because that helps share our videos. And leave us a wee comment, we always love to read what you have to say. Thank you very much for watching, don't forget follow us, follow them.